President Moon Jae-in begins a six-day trip that takes him to Singapore and Papua New Guinea. He is now in Singapore during his tour. While attending summit meetings, the South Korean leader will focus on the economy. Shin Se-min has our top story. President Moon Jae-in has touched down in the city-state of Singapore late Tuesday afternoon, the start of his two-nation tour, during which he will zero in on economic cooperation under the new southern policy he introduced a year ago. The trip comes just a couple of days after he revamped his economic team, replacing the finance minister and the presidential chief of staff for economic policy. From the 13th to the 16th, the president will be in the city-state of Singapore, attending summit meetings related to ASEAN, like the Korea-ASEAN summit and the ASEAN Plus Three summit, which includes Korea, China and Japan, and the East Asian summit. There, the president is expected to propose measures that will help accelerate his new southern policy, such as hosting a special Korea ASEAN summit in 2019 and setting up a Korea Mekong summit to bring Korea together with countries like Cambodia and Laos. On the last two days of his tour, from the 17th till the 18th, President Moon will be in Papua New Guinea for the Asia-Pacific Summit, which brings together 21 countries from the Pacific Rim. The president plans to outline his vision for an innovative and inclusive nation and to pitch the idea of creating a joint APEC Digital Innovation Fund, which will be used to improve the region's digital capabilities. The president will also be squeezing bilateral summits in between meetings, trying to bring the international community on board his strive for peace on the divided Korean peninsula. Bilateral meetings with leaders including Russian President Vladimir Putin and Australian Prime Minister Scott Morrison have already been confirmed. The one-on-one -on -one meetings with the U.S. Vice President and the Chinese President, the Blue House says, are still in the works. Meetings where President Boon will try to put some speed on what appears to be slowing progress on North Korea-related diplomacy. Shin Zemin, Arirang News.